Hello, Big Mocker. Big Mocker, baby, how you been? How are you doing today? Here, this might be a little bit easier for you. Per your advice, I chose to chase Slumdog Millionaire down that rabbit hole. Here, take a look at this real quick. All right, Big Mocker. So the first place I started was EBSCO Host. I found an article that turned out to be a teaching aid. It had topics that included neoliberalism, the global south, and the filmmaker controversy surrounding the underpayment of actors, the western influence in media globalization, and feminist sentiment within the movie. For me, this was a very good place to start. So after that, I decided to chase the rabbit geared towards the slumdog millionaire payment controversy. So this brief article reports on how Fox Searchlight didn't pay the child actors union rates. This seems to be a problem for developing countries and film. Fox Searchlight defended itself by stating how they've paid child actors three times the adult average salary and has educational trusts in place for the child stars. Now, in the Huffington Post article, there was some mention about Southern Asia distribution. So the third article by the LA Times goes into that. In this article, it talks about how Indian distribution is a top priority now. It talks about how Reliance, a division of India-based big cinemas, is moving into North America in hopes to capture a growing Indian market. Their goal is to make the lobby at the theaters a place for Indian families to meet up before and after whatever film, cricket match, and other Indian-based media they are there to see. Pretty impressive stuff, huh, Big Mocker? Now... In that third article by the LA Times, there was some mention about advertising. So I decided to chase the rabbit a little bit more and found an article that talks about how media advertising is so ever-present in dense urban Indian cities that the locals incorporate the ads into their everyday life. Movie posters and film boards become places for impromptu pedestrian art as well as a good spot for drying cow dung. Crazy stuff, huh? The globalization of Western media has merged with Bollywood, creating a gigantic film industry in Southern Asia. Now the fifth article that I found discusses the history of India cinema and how filmmakers referred to as Maharashtrians help point out human rights issues like those associated with the caste system. Fall the rabbit pretty far down that hole, I believe. So tell me what you think, Big Mocker. Crazy stuff, huh? So, uh, thank you for coming along with me down the, uh, down the rabbit hole, Big Mocker. Look forward to seeing you soon, baby. Take care.